The Lunar Control, though, was really born out of the, uh, the desire to achieve the ultimate lightweight performance golf shoe. I mean, it goes back to, you know, watching like a, you know, Michael Johnson, you know, with, uh, you know, the gold running shoes. If you are shaving off three or four ounces in a shoe compared to a typical golf shoe, but yet you can still get that performance, that adds up. About 10,000 steps, give or take, over the course of 18 holes. And if you're saving three or four ounces, that adds up to, believe it or not, about two tons that you're not having to cart around. The fatigue factor, at the end of the day, your, your feet feel a little bit fresher. And that's something you can appreciate. It's something all golfers of all levels, I think, can appreciate. You have to have impeccable traction with, with the ground. Maybe that one time that I get on a ridiculous side slope, playing in, let's say, Europe, in some sloppy conditions right. that I, I need to know that I'm going to be 100% you know, sure I'm not going to lose grip. This shoe provides that grip. And one of the things I've, I haven't always done brilliantly is the pushing off of the right foot correctly. Power channel in there is the big thing which allows me to do it correctly. Now I'm the one who's got to do it correctly, Yeah. but if that sole didn't have that power channel it would be very, very difficult to do. And the flywire also allows me to put that pressure through and keep the foot within that shoe. You know, it doesn't roll out over the sole. I feel if I lose that, then I lose my power.